Thank you for tuning in to Cascuda Motor Vlogs, everybody. Well, today is uh, May 17th, 2021. And as you see it, I just got done putting in some gas. The topic of this here uh, video is going to be for anybody that's uh, thinking about buying themselves a scooter. Wondering how reliable they might be. And uh, whoever uh, already read the reviews and are getting discouraged. So, real quick, guys. There are uh, some name brand scooters out there that do cost like three and a half or three thousand and a half and uh, four thousand or more. Those are your Vespas, your uh, Ruckuses, Piazzos, and there's a lot more. But um, the people that's uh, really putting a lot of bad reviews about Chinese scooters, this one is from Taiwan, but it's still considered a Chinese scooter. You know, but um, yeah. I want to tell you what my last experience is owning this scooter for almost a whole year now. Damn near just about a month off of being a year. So, I was reading the re reviews and I took my gamble, man, uh, buying myself this year a uh, 50cc scooter. And I've already made another purchase of a 150cc scooter because after owning this almost a year for about 11 months, I freaking like it, man. I mean, they're not what the reviews uh we're talking about to be you know it, a lot of people say these are piece of crafts you break down so quick this and that man hey if you got a pretty good wallet man go for it buy yourself with something that costs a uh, good old three thousand and a half four thousand dollars more power to you but man i'm on a budget man and i know a lot of other people are working on a budget as well so these are for the people that's in a, uh, working on a budget that's interested in a china scooter and an honest review of it so give it to you guys straight man buy yourself a scooter man if you know how to change a, a dry belt if you know how to change oil and you know how to pump gas buy yourself a scooter man ride it right it'll treat you right so basically guys I'm gonna get off this scooter give you guys another eyeball about what I'm working with right here so as you can see I got these saddle bags that I'm not too fond of but I do a lot of shopping this is my only vehicle I have I've gotten a car accident. I didn't have full coverage and my car got totaled and the uh, case was dismissed, but I was without a car So I got my stimulus payment the first one that came in and I wanted to make sure I bought something that was going to be reliable And uh, I didn't want to go with the used car because in the past every time I bought a used car for a thousand bucks thousand two hundred thousand uh, five hundred It just became to be a lemon nothing but problems man I had to put a lot of money into it and whatnot or it just didn't run and it was too expensive to uh, fix but with this here scooter guys it's brand new engine right I got a brand new engine on here and I'm the only owner and I know how I've been taking care of this engine and I'm confident that it's gonna take care of me man I don't do no wheelies I don't do no jumps I haven't dropped the scooter I mean I mean I, I treat it very delicate because it's my only transportation yeah it might be a 50 cc scooter but it gets me to point A point B and back to point A so it was a thousand bucks well spent guys a little bit on the expensive side even for a scooter such as but if you find them used for 500 you don't know what kind of uh, stuff that the previous owners uh, put the scooter through because the real parts are in the inside of the um, the engine now if you're the only owner and you know that you uh, lubricated the oil you change out the oils regularly you know that you only put uh, supreme gas in there 91 octane or wherever it might be in your state as long as it's supreme and uh, you change out the gear oil and you uh, are going to need to swap out your dry belt regard I mean if you're riding already over a thousand to two thousand uh, kilometers you might want to expect that and change it out man but yeah the only thing I've been doing in this is change out the oil every month change out the gear oil every two to three months but I do stay on top of changing out that oil every month and uh, I put in supreme gas and I change out my dry belt I had a back tail light that went out minor man buy another one I replaced it I had a front light that went out I replaced it bought another one replaced it that's just minor issues guys but I'm very pleased with this that I went ahead and uh, bought me a 150 cc scooter and uh, spent another 1200 on a bigger scooter this is a 50 cc so now I'm getting a 150 cc and I'm keeping them both guys and I believe I'm gonna have transportation for a long time now now these scooters this is all stock it does uh, 
on a no windy day it does 38 39 miles an hour and i did hit 40 41 but it does do about 38 any day on no wind day 39 and uh when it is windy it's going to be like 31 32 miles an hour 30 miles an hour now if you're going with the wind you're going to do like 43 miles an hour i weigh 215 pounds and sometimes i weigh this stuff down with a lot of groceries and whatnot so I'm putting close to like 300 pounds on this thing and I'm still hitting speeds of 38 miles an hour, almost 40. So with that being said guys, I hope I have uh, changed your mind. Maybe give you some hopes because it don't take no $3,000 to get yourself a scooter that's going to be reliable. I'm doing it with just a thousand bucks guys and you can too. So like right now guys, I've been on the road already 12 miles. And I've been doing speeds of 33 going into the, the winds coming my way. So I'm at 33 miles an hour. I've been on the I've been going this direction for the last 12 miles. Just pulled over to put some gas in and uh, start this review with you guys. And it says I have a maximum maximum speed of 33. I've been 12 miles 0.19. So man, there's my review, my honest giving review to you guys, man. Buy yourself a scooter, you won't be uh, disappointed. If you continue reading the bad reviews of people that's really down talking them, man, don't don't listen to those reviews, guys. Buy yourself a scooter, treat it right, it'll treat you right. Everybody have a blessed day. Thank you for watching. I hope to see you on my next video. God bless.